Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of my survival world. In this one we're going to be planning on finishing out the Japanese village here where we left off with the giant Japanese gong. We've only got a couple more little sections to kind of build up on and uh, we'll be looking pretty good. So over here I'm going to be starting off with a with a bit of a taller building, kind of a three-floored design here. And as I was in progress of constructing that, I also decided to start farming some music discs. So I'm building up a little bit of collection here. Uh, you know, we already got the nice pig step, so that's one of the uh, one of the nice ones. But we gotta collect up the others. Anyways, here is some of the roof designs and how they are coming out, looking very very nice. Now arriving at the finished form of this building, I think it turned out a lot better than I anticipated and the height difference is kind of nice to give a little bit of variation to the, all the builds in this village. Okay, it is now the next day, so I logged on to the unfortunate news of the new Minecraft patch 1.18.10 and uh, unfortunately my potato XP farm that has gotten me to 1000 levels and many more levels uh, earlier on is finally gone so that's a little bit underwhelming but you know I guess it was bound sooner to happen or later so now my best course of action is to go back to my roots and get my villagers up and running again uh, since I haven't used them in quite a while my uh, trade prices have kind of skyrocketed a bit so gotta get them back down and while I'm at it I'm gonna be farming up some resources as I'm running quite dry so I ended up coming back to this building as it didn't have an interior before and I built up a little bit of an inside here so we've got our bottom floor with a couple of chests and furnaces with a nice floor design and then up this ladder here we have a couple of beds a little bit of a sleeping area with a nice ceiling as well. So we are on to one of the last sections for the building areas so I'm going to be going with one of the rectangular buildings on this little mound here give it some elevation and uh, it was pretty straightforward to build it here it is in its finished form unfortunately it does not have any sort of interior um, I don't know if I'm gonna do anything with that or just leave it because of the lack of space and with a little bit more environmental work I think it is safe to say that the entire Japanese village is complete now um, as I'm doing a little run around and closing out the video I would like to hear any of your guys' feedback or, or critiques on this video. Uh, what you liked, what you didn't like, as um, I don't mean to address the elephant in the room, but the last few videos have uh, not been doing as well as I'd hoped for, so that means that there is room for improvement in my videos, and I'd love to hear what you have to say. Alright, thanks.